It's dubbed the love drug and is offering new hope to those with chronic abdominal pain. Researchers have found a way to use the natural hormone oxytocin to target problem areas. It's a naturally occurring feel-good hormone released during times of social enjoyment and also during childbirth to help a mother bond with her baby. But now scientists may have found a way to spread the love even more. We've found an old hormone with a new trick, uh, reducing pain in the gut. Never thought to, to be like that. Professor Paul Aylwood and his team have been able to alter oxytocin so it's able to survive in the body long enough to reach the colon. We would anticipate the way that this molecule works, that it would work directly on what are called the pain receptors, the pain nerves, the ones that transmit pain in the gut. The development offers hope to people with a range of conditions, including irritable bowel syndrome, which affects around 11% of the Western population. Some have it chronically in their life, with few treatments available, certainly none for pain. Sometimes the pain can be quite excruciating. Like many others, IBS sufferer Jelan Myers is desperately waiting for an effective treatment. Anything that's um, easily obtainable, cost effective and immediate and safe over the longer term, they would get their lives back. So we believe these people will have a new and safer um, treatment of pain that should work in, in a rapid fashion. Like with any new drug, it will still take several years before it's available on shelves. Kath Landers, Nine News.